So many people take it for granted to go to their job every single day. They have the same job or they stay in the same place for five, six, seven, eight years. I don't live like that. I can't just go and pick up and practice in another state. I am a social worker and there's definitely a disconnect, especially with the licensure and things along that line because each state isn't the same as the state previously. So if I don't pass my test, then wherever I go next, I don't know what the laws are. I don't know where I'm going to be with it and how long it's going to take me to get it. So it's not fun. It's not fun. My name is Natalie West and this is my story of chasing work. They say social work, you don't choose it, it kind of chooses you. And I've always been the person that wants to help, no matter who it is, what it is. That's why I went back to school. My husband was deployed when I went back to school to begin with, and I had a baby. So when he would rest, I would read. I would be up until one, two, three o'clock in the morning doing schoolwork. And then you think when you're done with school, it's finally time to take this passion and ignite it. And you are just slapped with all of these different obstacles before we can even practice independently the processing, the fees, all of the like transferring of the licensure. I have to then accrue about 3,000 hours and each state doesn't always accept those hours. When we move state to state as a military spouse, we'll be lucky if we're in the same spot for two, three years. So it's a constant chopping block. You can't just pick up where you left off. A lot of the times you're in the hole. So when you're connecting the dots, you get lost because a lot of the dots don't line up and time is lost, money's lost, families suffer. I've spent six years of my life, I've put my family through a lot to obtain these degrees, which I thought I was gonna be able to help. Well, everything's biting on a piece of paper, the licensure itself. What's the purpose of going through all these schooling and all the internships that you don't get paid for? And you pay them. And you're very bitter when you get out that you are this far, and yet you're so far still that you have to go. I'm still sitting here with this one little thing holding me back from reaching my true potential my true goal, which is to help people. Everybody's affected, social work, doctors, whoever. The lack of consistency with the licensure holds a lot of people back. It creates a lot of obstacles that need to just go away. It would open up a lot more doors for us to make a bigger impact on the community that needs us the most and that's why I'm passionate about it, because it's who I am. I've always been a fighter. Let's put work back in reach. <laughs>